everyone. Welcome to Mornings with Maggie. Today we're going to focus on the thoracic spine. From here to about here, we're going to rotate just sideways, straight planes again, just sideways, middle, side, and middle. I like to keep hands on my knees. Here are my hips, just so you know where I am in the shot. And so let's go to the side and middle. Just noticing where you feel that movement, either shoulders, or more in the mid spine, maybe a little bit lower. Turn, come back. Turn, just to the side, middle, side, middle, side, middle. We'll do 10, nine, eight, seven, turn six, five, sunlight coming in again, four, three, two, middle, and one, hold it here for me, find where you can push a little bit, lift that chest up, turn your head, chest up, shoulder blades down, hold this stretch, not painful, Breathe in and out for me, squeezing the breath out. Breathing in, more at the belly, breathe out. Squeeze, good, breathe in, breathe out. Excellent, let's go the other direction. Turn, middle. It feels weird going the other way, but you can go turn, middle. Turn, middle, 10 here, 10 and nine make sure your low back's curved in you're sitting up seven six five four turning at your chest two and one hold it here find where your arms can help position you chest up breathing in and out blow the air out breathe in Breathe in, one more. Excellent, both directions. A Little bit bigger with your arms. So here you're not worrying about pushing the neck or worrying about twisting the neck. It will happen naturally. Think about twisting at your shoulder blades, breastbone right where the sternum meets the ribs. Turn, 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 one more, very good. Okay, to the middle, let's do some flexion and extension for our thoracic spine. So right here, just these top layers, not top levels for now, it's like we're a cake. Top layers of your spine going down and extending. So try to hold the spine steady in your up position to about right here. And then I want you to bend those top part portions of your spine, lift up and over. Doesn't mean you don't move down below, but try to hold what's down here a little bit more firm. And bend over and lift up. It's helpful to have that hand there to give you some feedback of where should you focus your bending. Down and lifting up. Don't reinforce the down forward position too much. We are already there normally. So down a little bit, extending, lifting up and back. Down and in, extending up and back. Good, up and back again. All right, let's do a little bigger movement. So more like your waist down. So only kind of curving in down here, then lift up. Really extend from belly button and waist back. Good, down and in. So it's okay if you're in the back of your chair, but you still need to be able to move. Lifting up and back. And up and back. Great. From here, let's do some side bending. So shoulder to the hip. Good, and up. Do that shoulder to hip. So we're opening the opposite side, a little movement in. 
don't lift up this shoulder. Just work on the squeezing on the side you're moving down. Go five more times here. Four, three, feel that opening and open here. Good, hold it for just a second. Feeling that nice stretch in your torso. Good. All right, other side, bending down and in. Bending means just to the side, this plane, down and up. If you find what feels good, you stay there. All right, hold the stretch on your next one or now when you're ready. Murphy's barking. held positions. Focus on your breathing out and in. Whew. Think about maybe we found some new room here in your midsection and let's do a little bit of all those movements one more time to reinforce what we have. Side to side. Excellent. Let's go flexion extension. So rounding down, lifting up. This time, if you can, sit up and over your chair. And reach forward, round down to flexion. Extend up and over. Reach forward, round down. And extending up and over. Very nice, let's side bend. So to one side, to the other. Gentle here. Side to side. I said don't lift the shoulder up and here I'm doing it too. Focus on that down movement. light touch. Stay away from anything that feels painful, any of that kind of movement, then you just get back to midline and work on midline stability. Okay, super. You're doing great with all your new um, therapy words or kind of the movement words we're learning along with the spine. Let's move into some quadrants. So let's go from our midline to flexion and rotation, side bending. Let's go forward and left. We'll do the same thing. I'll talk us through it. Forward and left. So I want you to slowly start to move from top down to bottom. Here's top, right at that collarbone or so, maybe a little above. Bottom's right here above your belly button or so. So start taking the shoulder forward and left. Come back up. Forward and left. A little bit bigger. Come back up. Forward and left. Come back up. In your biggest movement here, forward and left. Now let's make them small again. So we go small, 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 big, big, bigger, then smaller, 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 up. So we're gonna reverse it. Start from the beginning with me, here we go. So a small forward and left, a little bit bigger, a little bigger, thinking about the up just as important, and your biggest movement. Now make it a little smaller, up, more, smaller, and this is our last one. Excellent. Let's reverse that to go back to the right, extending and rotating away. So we've been forward left, let's go back right. So here, take your torso, lean back and to the right. It's kind of funny, left shoulder goes back. Lean up again. Good, let's do small, medium, big. Three movements this direction. Small, move up and left a little bigger. Good, up and left your biggest movement, but not painful. And let's get small, up and left. And smallest here. Good, let's move from forward left. Oh, sorry, I was saying it wrong, up and right. So down and front, up and back. Just. Give me what you got to that forward um, angle up and back. Forward and up and back. Feel those shoulders rotating. Down and left, up and right. Super. Let's go the other direction. Find middle. Whew. All right. So let's take our shoulders. Let's turn the spine where it goes down to the right. So this part's gonna twist a little bit bigger on top, down to the right, and then it comes back up. Down a little bigger, three times, small, medium, large, medium, small. 
Okay, here we go. Take your top, go down to the right, and middle. Down to the right, a little bit bigger. Middle, down, and middle. Good, go medium here. Smallest down, middle. Okay, good. Up and to, I'm going up left. So now we're gonna go up and over, up and over, up and over, then middle, then small. Here we go. Small, up and back, medium, find that quadrant, big. Go back to medium and small. Good, now so let's find forward, right, up and left and feel the shoulders, everything kind of rotates. Forward, right, up and left, not moving down below. Forward, right, up and left. Not forcing any movement, just feeling where you can move. Okay, super, last thing we're gonna do, take your ribs, and I want you to move your ribs over your low back. So move your trunk in a circle, moving forward and backwards, and then reverse it. So hands on my hips to keep myself stable down low, and then I'm gonna reach my chest forward, back, side. Reach forward, side, back, forward, side, and back. Okay, and then let's go the other direction. See if you can make that movement big over. So you need um, something to look at. I've got the camera as my feedback and you've got something shiny, reflective, or mirror. Shiny, reflective, mirror. That's usually the same thing. Pop your chair in front of your bathroom mirror. Super. All right. So that was a lot of focused movement on our trunk. Thank you for working with me. Um, if you feel great, then uh, go back to doing some of the neck work or um, time to do some cardio or some more stability work, maybe getting up and down off the floor, maybe working on push-ups, and uh, just keep going whatever you do. Come back and see me in another video. Thanks.